All right, guys, welcome to the channel. In today's episode, we're gonna go to the Whitney Laboratory and we are gonna do the redfish release. Uh, Nassau grouper. The snook, he's got snook in here. Let's check this one out. Wow, that's, look at the Nassau, that's a Nassau grouper. Hey, oh, coming up, you are not camera shy. Wow, look at that grouper. That's the snook here. That's a lot of snook. You don't see too many snook in this area. They're all here. <laughs> We're headed to release some redfish for the Whitney Laboratory, man. This is uh, it's pretty exciting. These fish, they, uh, they've hatched them inside the laboratory. Now what we're gonna do is uh, release them into the wild. They've got uh, redfish today, but they have spawned uh, spotted sea trout. They've done mangrove snapper. And this is today's the redfish release. So this is good for the fishing community. It's to boost the, uh, the amount of fish that are in this fishery uh, boost tourism does everything bring brings in the natural uh, habitat back to what it used to be like for our grandfathers and you know and their grandfathers what the fishery used to be like is what these guys are striving to do here at the Whitney laboratory which is affiliated with the uh, University of Florida and um, and uh, Captain Adam here he's taking us on the quest today that's right welcome aboard yeah, man. They've hatched a bunch of uh, redfish and we're gonna release them into the wild. And we're taking the litter getter. That's the redfish, right? Yeah. Thanks for doing it. Just so the camera Captain gets... Chuck Glycklin, the Flagler Sport Fishing Club. This has been kind of one of my projects that I've worked with the Whitney Labs over the last year, year and a half, to uh, start to grow and to release redfish in the local waters. You know, there's a lot of discussion about saving Mosquito Lagoon and saving the Everglades, but nobody's saving Palm Coast and St. Augustine and Foreman Beach. And um, I kind of took it upon myself and a couple of other people to start to do some things locally. And uh, people at Whitney Labs were absolutely kind and considerate enough to say, we can do that. And today we're going to release 100,000 baby redfish into our local waters. I'm so excited and so proud to be part of this. And as you can see from everybody that's here, all the local captains, there's captains, there's guides, there's local anglers, there's, you know, people walking in from the street say, give me a bucket, I wanna put some fish in the water. Um, it's just it's just a great experience. It's great to have the community involved and I'm just so excited to be able to be part of it. Captain Chuck, thanks for inviting us along, man. Oh, you're very welcome. And we're honored that you put, that you that you joined us. Happy to. Thanks, let's, my friend. Let's go get some fish and release them. Yep. See you soon. Okay. There's also a little fact sheet on there. There's an email address. The email address I want you to email us the GPS release location so we can keep track. All right. Here's the red fish. They need a lot of oxygen, so what I would say is. Um, Keep an eye on them, make sure that they are released in a protected area, like oysters and deep water, yep. you know the drill. Uh, creek. 15, what? The creek? That's a baby redfish. Let's get it back in. 15 already is Okay. Yeah. Here's some more. Can you do one more? We yeah. got a whole other cooler. We can take right, as, yeah, coming. give us as many as you want. Keep them coming. Right. Yep. What do you think, two buckets yeah. per? I got the permit. Hey, Ani! Right. What's up? Ani, you're on the channel again. You made it. 
Adam, one more? Or good? Yeah. Like, you, you tell me. Like, yeah, your Eric is pretty good. You, you're good. Litter get her. Yeah. Janung's. Janung's fish camp. Captain Adam. FWC permits, all okay. that stuff is legit. Um, so we're good. Thank cool. you. Thank you, gentlemen. Absolutely. All we right. appreciate Thanks it. Thanks for helping the uh, community, we're the fishing community. We're this is cold, boy. It is cold. The wind is like really brisk. watching this video sitting at home nice and warm we are releasing thousands upon thousands of redfish into these intercoastal waterways can't exactly show you our locations that we're releasing these fish but but uh they'll, they'll be uh, call me i'll let you know call me <laughs> yeah captain adam will let you know <laughs> Look at all those redfish. Oh, I'll get them. <laughs> sail away with me, sail, sail away. Have you ever had this many redfish on your boat? Sail away with me, sail, sail away. Sail away with me, sail, sail. Survive. <laughs> Survive! Survive! Live! <laughs> Live another day! <laughs> this one's going to med school. <laughs> That's Billy. <laughs> Survive, Billy! Definitely one of the coolest things I've ever been a part of. Put it up on the bow. On the bow? I like how your voice got deep. <laughs> Put it up on the bell. <laughs> we lifted something. <laughs> We're going to try to get these fish back into the little creeks and tributaries where they can find some shelter and protection so the larger fish that we find out here don't make a quick meal out of them. Yeah, man. Put them on there. Right on that oyster bar. This is where these uh, redfish will grow and mature and find some shelter and uh, hopefully spawn some more. Guys, if you want to be a part of the litter getter, come on out uh, to the Matanzas River Keepers here at Janung's Fish Camp. What's the address on that? 291 Cubbage Road. 291 Cubbage Road. Come out and uh, come out to these flats areas with us and we'll uh, or Captain Adam Morley here and we'll pick up we'll pick up some trash. We'll have a nice boat ride. It's free. Get a nice boat ride and you just gotta pick up some trash. Do good things. Do good things for the community in the area. And we are we are one, just one of, what was that, like 20 boats, 10 boats? Yeah, almost two dozen boats, I'd say. About two dozen, about two dozen boats. That's what Captain Adam says. So yeah, we're just one of about two dozen boats that have hundreds upon hundreds. We, our boat, I think we took a, uh, over a thousand, maybe a thousand plus. So, doing our thing. Guys, you can be a part of this. I'm going to put uh, all my uh, links in the description below. 
Uh, make sure you uh, subscribe if you haven't already subscribed to this channel. We're going to be doing a lot more cool stuff like this. Like go out with Captain Adam again. We're going to get some trash. Pick up some uh, litter on this litter getter. And we're also going to be uh, putting more fish in when they give us that call. They've got trout. Uh, spotted trout. And they've also got uh, mangrove snapper. They're going to be doing redfish again. And we're going to keep releasing them to get these fisheries back to what they used to be when our grandfathers taught us how to fish here. We're trying to bring them back and uh, keep this place plentiful. But uh, thanks a lot guys, uh, hit the like button for me, subscribe, uh, check out the Whitney Laboratory, and uh, also Fish Bites. Make sure you get some Fish Bites. Uh, that's where it was created, right there. So, I couldn't ask for a better day, this is glorious out here. We're gonna head back, it's, it's still a little chilly. We gotta get into that channel where the wind's gonna blow. But, uh, Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Keep it reeling.